Hi and welcome to Belgian Diecast Restorations. I'm Johan and last week I restored a mod rod which was one of Matchbox's fantasy hot rod models of the early 70s. This week I'm tackling another fantasy model, the 37D Super Cooper. This model was made to look like a futuristic fantasy version of a 60s hot rod with a large windscreen, retro padded seats and a race back with a large visible engine in the rear. It belonged in the row of other creatively named fantasy models like the Stretcher Fetcher, the Tojo, the Tire Fryer and the Blaze Buster. The Super Cooper model was introduced in 1973 as a follow-up to the 37C cattle truck. It was mainly issued in metallic blue with no decals, but had various color variations over the years including metallic pink, orange, lime and red. The pink version often received the same flower sticker on the roof as the 13E buggy. The engine in the rear was reused in other models like the 30D Beach Buggy and the 58D Whoosh and Push. With a windscreen this large and vulnerable, it's very hard to find play-worn models with an intact windscreen. Often the engine is also missing as it's only held in place by two small plastic pins. On this model both the windscreen and the engine survived, but it got in the hands of a creative young owner who painted it silver, getting paint on the windows and wheels. So let's get out the tools and give this model a factory reset.
After the 1F Modrat last week, I thought it would be a good idea to tackle another fantasy super fast model. This 37D Super Cooper was painted over in metallic silver by one of its owners, getting paint on the wheels and window. Also the engine had lost a lot of its chrome. I like these quirky models with their crazy names, so I really wanted to give this one a complete factory reset. The Tamiya light metallic blue is a very good match for this model. I rechromed the engine, polished the window and sprayed the interior, which had faded in the sun. Now it looks like it came right out of the box 50 years ago. If you enjoy my videos, please leave me a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and tick the notification bell. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.